Balloons Tower Defense, there are two factions, the Balloons and the Monkeys. And normally, we focus entirely on the Monkeys, what they can do, the towers, the damage, the upgrades, the T20s, all of that. But today, we're actually going to be showing the Balloons a little bit of love. And today, we've added 34, yes, you heard me correctly, 34. Four new and different types of balloons into the game. Like always, guys, if you enjoy these types of modded videos, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications. That way you don't ever miss any awesome videos when we upload it. All right, so here's all of the balloons that are added. Holy cow, there is so many things. What? There's some new Moabs. There's some new, what is this, like a pink? Moab? That's pretty cool. Let's test them out. Let's see what these balloons are all about. So it looks like we go from red and it looks like we have this dark red, kind of this burgundy class balloon. And so it looks like, okay, so the dark red just splits into two blue, two red balloons. So the blue balloon normally just turns into one red balloon, but this balloon turns into two red balloons. So I would s assume that this balloon's actually stronger than a blue balloon because it actually transforms into way more reds. So that's very interesting. So red, and it kind of like works its way up. So there's a blue and now there's a dark blue. And I'm assuming that just turns into two. Whoa. Okay, so the dark blue turns into two dark red balloons. So the dark blue balloon then turns into that. All right, so the next one is a, looks like it's a wood. Huge shout out to today's modder, Aubrey, for making some amazing custom balloons. It li literally, it's like wood. What? Wait, can... Wait, it's... Oh, it's hitting it. It is hitting it. Let's see. Is it gonna prop it? Whoa, okay. It doesn't have any children balloon, but it is relatively tanky. Look, so you have to hit it, and then it looks like it's cracking the wood, kind of like Minecraft. And then it just pops. Uh, next up, looks like it's some kind of metallic balloon. It does. It's like an uh, orange metal balloon. And it does classify as that. Let's see. If we put down a red hot rings. But it instantly pops with one shot. So it's, so it's a lead balloon that is super weak. It has no children balloon whatsoever. And it immediately, it's like a rust, you know what it reminds me of? It's like a rusted balloon, like a rusted lead balloon. It still has lead properties, but it's really weak, super easy to deal with. As long as you have anything that pops lead, you're good. Next up, looks like it's a dark green. I'm assuming this is just follows this, right? Whoa, okay. So yeah, dark green, it kind of follows that same trajectory as the dark qualities or types of balloons. So the dark green balloon turns into two dark blues and both dark blues turn into two dark reds. So that's a lot of red balloons. And next up, we have the dark yellow, which I'm assuming is just gonna turn into two dark greens. Each dark green turns into this. So it, it could get out of hand really quickly, actually. Right, like this this dark monkey barely was able to deal with it. All right, well, let's just say we get even more attacks, right? Let's just see what happens. And let's get faster shooting and let's just spawn a bunch of them. What happens? I mean, that is a look at how many balloons that is. That's crazy. And then there's the pink, which turns into those. Yeah, I mean, we're looking how many balloons are getting by. Not able to deal with it. So as we start leveling up, getting a little bit further along, gonna be difficult. So this next balloon is a yellow balloon that has a lightning bolt on it. Is it just really fast? Whoa. Wait, what? It's, wait, 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 wait. Did we pop it? We didn't do it. Did we do any damage to it? All right, we are doing damage to it. Wait, is it, does it? It looks like it slows down towers. I could be wrong about this. Wait, I want to see something. So if I just do this, one, two, three, four. No way. Okay, so this balloon slowed, look at this, one. So this balloon actually slows your towers down. Whoa, that's really cool. So a yellow balloon that slows down your towers. All right, I like that. Next up is a pink balloon, but it's 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 a magic balloon. So it's a pink magic. So let's see what this let's see what this bad boy is all about. So a pink magic balloon. So a pink magic balloon. I'm assuming is it immune to magic? So if we put Gwendolyn down, is it immune to magic? It is. So it's immune to magic, and it has one pink and two purples in it. Pretty, pretty strong. Next up, looks like we have variations of black and white balloons. I'm not entirely sure they look strong or they just have, oh no. So these just follow the same principles. 
of our- we're gonna call them shaded balloons. I don't know if that's the official name for them, but they seem that they're shaded variants, right? And they just have tons of balloons. Like, that's- look at that. We're gonna probably have to get some stronger towers here in a moment. Next up is a lead. Looks like a new variation of the lead. Obviously, he can't hit it. Gwendolyn might be able to do something here. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that's not bad. That's still pretty strong. It's kind of a mix between a ceramic and a lead. But next up is the coconut balloon. Coconut balloon, let's go. <laughs> I've actually did a video on this. This is a, this is a secret balloon that Ninja Kiwi made, but I don't believe they actually ever implemented it. Whoa, it's pretty strong too. Look at this. Is it going gonna, gonna to pop it? Barely. So you need a triple shot dart monkey to be able to pop it. So that's not too shabby. Next up is a frozen balloon. Wait, oh my gosh, it's a moving frozen balloon. No way. Wait, you know what's funny is we that means we can get we can get this this tax or this spike factory and we can get white hot spikes because that can cut through frozen balloons. There we go. I think that's one of the first times I've ever gotten white hot spikes to, to pop frozen balloons. Wait, isn't there something that can pop only frozen balloons and not? Let's see. Wait, wait, wait. Larger freeze area. So cold snap. Can can freeze and pop lead and camo. Isn't there one that can refreeze? So does the ice monkey? Can the ice? This is what I want to know. Can the ice monkey freeze this balloon? He cannot. It's actually immune to being frozen. Whoa. So it counters the ice monkey. I mean, it's kind of like a white balloon, but it's also, it's like a, a white lead balloon. I like that. All right. So this looks like it's, um, and is it also, wait, is it also resistant? Look at this. Gwendolyn can't do any damage either. It's a magic lead balloon. Red hot rings. Okay. So magic lead. So you can't pop it with fire or any magic type. So you need to be able to have like a sniper or some kind of primary explosive to be able to deal with that. Next up is a white lead balloon. Wait, cause this mean you can't freeze it? What? Okay, you can freeze. Oh, you we are doing damage to it. Okay, but you can't just normally freeze it. Weird, very weird, but still really cool. Oh my gosh, fortified. Oh my, wait, it just said immune. Look at that, it's, wait, immune? How do you pop it then? Immune. All right, Legend of the Night. All right, Legend of the Night can pop it, right? Okay, Legend of the Night can pop it, that's all you need. All right, next up is, it's like a dark ceramic. Lead ceramic, ew, ew. Okay, Dragon's Breath. All right, so fire can pop it. So it's a lead ceramic. All right, what about a white ceramic? Obviously, normal doesn't pop it. Full metal jacket? All right, that can hit it. Full metal jacket can hit it, but man, it's still... Oh, look at this, and then there's a... Wait, wait, what? Holy cow, look at how tanky that is. Whoa. Okay, so it's just... It's like that. It's like uh, removing the chocolate layer off of a, like an egg or something. <laughs> Those are pretty. Wait, what the heck is this balloon? It's a white and black polka dot. Oh my gosh! Look at how many balloons. What the heck? That's so many balloons. All right, let's put this here. Let's get long range, super long range, and then more tax. All right, overdrive. Let's see if we can pop this. Let's see if this can even pop it. Oh my gosh, long range, super long. And let's get Ring of Fire. Can a Ring of Fire pop this thing? Uh, there's no way it can't, right? Yeah, there it was able to, but 700, holy cow. If a bunch of these balloons came out, you'd be toast. All right, looks like we have crystal balloons coming up next. So a purple crystal. Okay, so a purple crystal has a pink balloon in it. That's pretty cool. A yellow crystal is has two energy balloons in it okay a blue crystal is immune to primary interesting so that's immune to primary what's this i'm assuming is this immune to military okay so that's immune to military wait is each oh wait 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 each one of these might be resistant so for example 
that might just be resistant. Oh, okay. So each crystal balloon is immune to a specific category of tower. So purple's immune to magic, support, primary, and military. That's cool. That is really cool. I think that's a really awesome idea. Having balloons that are immune to specific categories. If all of these were implemented in a game mode on balloons, that would be insane. All right, next up we have this red ceramic, which looks like it's just a smorgasbord of just a whole bunch of random things, right? Super weak, but it just has a bunch of random balloons in it. So, all right, we have the gradient balloon. Get it? It's gray and it's a gradient. It's a gradient balloon. Uh, I'm assuming it's lead. It's not. Oh my. Holy cow. It has all of the grays balloon. Oh my. There's no. Okay, okay, okay. Let's just get a bunch of just normal more tax overdrives. Okay. Let's just see how many overdrives it takes. Okay. All right. This should be enough overdrives, right? That's a lot of overdrives. Let's see what happens. All right, gradient balloon versus overdrive. Oh my, is that enough? Oh, look at this. Wait, no way, it's not enough? Overdrive is not a, like, small thing. Overdrive's pretty powerful. All right, what about the gradient balloon? Can we deal with it now? Barely. That's insane. Look at that. Wait, some of them even got through. Whoa. Wait, is this a brick balloon? Oh my gosh. So a brick, wait. Okay, so a brick balloon just is, a brick balloon is just armored ceramic. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, 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 Do not be fooled. Do not be fooled. There might be, I think there's multiple. There's two ceramics in a brick balloon. All right, don't be fooled. It's not just one ceramic, there's two ceramics hidden in there. And that was all of the balloons. Now we still have, now we're moving on to the Moab class balloons. All right, so normal Moab, and then it looks like it goes up to a gray. Whoa, that is evil looking. Let's see what happens against this gray. I love this gray Moab. That actually looks, holy cow. So instead of having four, oh man. Okay, so what if I just get an elite defender versus the gray Moab? Yeah, that can deal with it, but that has four brick balloons. All right, next up is a DDT, a gray DDT, but it doesn't have camo detection on it. And it looks like it has regen on it too. So pretty cool, pretty cool. Next up is the ice Moab. Let's see, how strong is the ice Moab? Ooh, that looks pretty strong. Not, and it has all ice Moabs on it. So that's pretty, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Look at that near, um, I mean, look at this top, look how many pops it takes. That's pretty strong. All right, next up we have normal ZOMG, BFB, and then whatever this balloon is. It is scary looking. All right, so it's uh, it's the black ZOMG with a skull on it. I mean, the normal ZOMG has a skull on it too. So let's see, inside of it, there is a... Oh my gosh, look at those DDTs. Can he pop it? He was not able to pop all of them though. So an elite defender could not deal with that. All right, next up is whatever the heck this is. What am I, what is? Oh my gosh, it has all of these balloons in it. Holy cow. Let's see, is he going to be able to pop it? He'll be able to pop it. Whoa, okay, that thing's pretty scary, not going to lie. Next up is the blue BAD. Here, let's go ahead. Let's get a cripple Moab. I don't know. Oh, this might not be good. This might not be good. We might need something else. Okay, let's also, I'm going to get a super monkey. I'll just get a dark champion. What's in the blue BAD? That's what I'm more worried about right now. Holy cow, it has four normal BADs. All right, I need a legend of the night. I need, I, without legend of the night, I'm kind of in trouble. Wait. Yeah, th and I think it just turns into normal BADs. Whoa, that's pretty crazy. All right, and last up is this pink Moab. So it's immune to stun really fast and has a bunch of towers in it. Oh man. No, Legend of the Night, go! Haha. <laughs> yeah, let's go, GG. And that is every single balloon showcase, my friends. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow for some more awesome content.